Learning to say, no, expressing dislike with, not into. Hello, English learners. Welcome to our lesson today. We are going to learn about a very useful English phrase, not into. This phrase is commonly used in casual conversation to express dislike or lack of interest towards something. Let's dive in. The phrase, not into, is a casual and somewhat indirect way of saying that you don't like or enjoy something, or that you're not interested in it. The construction is simple. You can put any noun, a thing, a person, an activity, after, not into, to indicate what you don't like or aren't interested in. Here's an example, I'm not into sports, meaning, I don't like or enjoy sports. It's a gentle way of expressing your dislikes, isn't it? Now that we understand what not into means, let's look at how we can use it in various sentences. 1. I'm not into jazz music. 2. She's not into cooking. 3. We're not into watching horror movies. In all these sentences, the speaker is expressing a dislike or lack of interest towards jazz music, cooking, or watching horror movies, respectively. Interestingly, you can also use not into with verbs. To do this, we add ing at the end of the verb. For instance, I'm not into swimming, meaning I don't enjoy the activity of swimming. How do you respond when someone uses the phrase, not into? Usually, people respond by expressing their own likes or dislikes, or by simply acknowledging the statement. For example, you're not into jazz? That's okay, I love rock music. You're not into swimming? I understand, it's not for everyone. And that's it for today's lesson, folks. Now you know how to use the phrase, not into, to express your dislikes or lack of interest in a casual, conversational way. Practice using this phrase in your everyday English. Remember, learning a language is all about practice. Thanks for joining us and happy learning!